An important aspect of chord inversions are the intervals formed due to the inverting of the chord's root position. In the following diagram, you'll notice that only the root position chord is made up of thirds. The first and second inversion chords are made up of thirds and fourths. Knowing where the interval of a fourth is situated is very important. This will help you to determine the location of the chord's root. The chord's root is always the upper pitch of the fourth. Each of the chords in the diagram is a C major chord. When the C major chord is in first inversion, the root C is the upper pitch in the interval of a fourth. When the C major chord is in second inversion, the root C is also the upper pitch in the interval of a fourth. Here is a helpful way to remember which inversion is which. If the root is the first pitch from the top, the chord is in first inversion. If the root is the second pitch from the top, the chord is in second inversion. Let's listen to how a C major chord sounds, first in root position, then first inversion, and finally second inversion. 